G'day guys, Batch here, welcome back to the channel and the Hunter Call of the Wild. I'm going to cross the border into Johnstorf, open up a few towers, and after we've done that, I'm going to zip over to Titchen out, hunt down a few bison. I'm armed with all the heavy equipment today, got the Ranger .338, the hook edge, and the shotgun with slugs in it. So, plan is today is to hit them hard, kill them fast. That's the plan. Still pretty early in the morning. Sun is still coming up. It's not all the way up in the sky yet. Looks pretty good too. Check this out. Not too bad at all. Got a red deer up near this tower somewhere, it just has put out a call. So I've gone to crouch, just gonna take my time. I'll pop out a call, we'll see what happens here. Haven't shot a male red deer for a while. I think last time was the bow hunt, if I remember rightly. So I'm eager to get this one. Not sure what this red deer is doing. Hasn't made a noise or a sound. Can't hear it. Got a roe deer up here though. Okay, here he is. Well, if he's the shotgun, gonna lose integrity, but what the hell. So my plan is off to a good start. I hit it hard, I hit it fast, and it's down. It's dead. <laughs> Yeah, no integrity at all. My fault using the shotgun. Probably should have used the arrow. Might have got a better money. I might have went to silver instead of bronze with the integrity score intact. But oh well, not to worry. We'll go open this tower. Grab the other one. And it's off to hunt some bison. It's one of those little structures. Pretty good to get on the roof of these things. And you can go in them as well. You use them how they're meant to be used. And here we are on the map. Got two more to grab. So put a waypoint here. Won't be shooting any small animals today. No foxes, roe deer or fallow deer. As you can see, didn't get integrity with the red deer. Shot it with the wrong gun. And after that, we've got the point. 338 range master so it's just really for bison today i don't want to have to track them far I just want to put them straight down get it over and done with and we'll pop this thing open and it's another little hunting structure so there we go one more to go and off to titcher now This one might actually be a tower, not one of those little hunting shed things. Looks like the area would put a tower in anyway. That's where I'd put one. So let's open it up. Yep, it's a tower. There's the last one. And I just want to pop down and have a look at the lake we have down here. I want to check that out. Because I haven't really hunted around there that much. There it is there. It's a pretty huge lake. It's really big. So we'll go there. Just have a quick look. Not a bad sized lake at all, looks pretty big. I've got to walk down here without breaking my neck. Just so I can get a little bit closer. See if there's any animals standing around waiting to be shot. I probably won't shoot him, because I don't have the right ammo or guns really today, unless I hit him with the bow and arrow. Should be right walking down here, just take my time. Because you can get injured coming down these things. If you hit a boulder hard enough, you probably die. Okay, made it without a problem. So walk over and get a bit closer to this lake and have a good look at it. Not too bad at all. 
Can't see any animals standing around that. It does look like a nice lake. It's pretty big. It's one of the biggest ones on this part of the map anyway. That's why I thought I'd pop in and have a look. Most likely a few drinking zones around this lake. I must admit I haven't walked all the way around it. I usually don't get on this part of the map. So that's most likely why. But I will check it out properly one day. But it won't be today. Oh, the one and only animal I have seen around the lake is that small male roe deer. So it's goodbye lake. And hello Titchen out. And we have... Bison in front of us is a small herd, so we'll see what happens here. Should be able to shoot one or two of these. I'm going to take this one with the 338, I think. Put a bullet straight into this thing. Went old cow bunger on me there, but it's down now. Let's check it out. That took two 338 bullets. It looked like three slugs. No quick kill bonus. Unbelievable. Died pretty fast. And the third slug didn't count because it was already dead standing there. But it took two 338 bullets, one hit in the lung, and it's still come at me. I've caught up to its friends. They're just in front of me here. So I'm going to take one of these. Let's have a little look. So we've got standing around. It's got to be a male or two in here somewhere. I haven't seen any yet though, but I'm sure there'll be some hanging around. This one just in here. I'm going to have to take that one. Here she comes. I got a good lung shot. Yeah, that hit. But it's running. We'll put another bullet into this. That should have fixed it up. Should be down now. Okay, it looks like a lot of blood. That looks like a vital hit there. And there it is. It's down dead. I'm not sure if the second shot hit it. It looked pretty good. We'll go over and have a look. It looked like a lung shot, that first one. Left lung, liver and stomach. And I got 88% of my quick kill bonus. So there we go. That's a bit better. Okay, I'm back on that herd's tail. I've got one just up here in a bush. Have a look what else we've got walking around. There's a few of them still. Yeah, I might take this one. It's pretty close. Get a good lung shot in on him or her. Where are you? There we go. Oh, yeah, smacked it real bad. And it's calling. Still alive, though. So I better take the scope off. Grab the shotgun just in case it runs at me. No, that's not going anywhere. It is down. So there we go. This Ranger, uh, the Range Master, sorry, 0 0.338 is doing a good job. I do have the polymer tip bullets in, so they're a tad harder, and that one's going straight down. These bison keep trying to walk back from where we started. Not sure where they're trying to go, but I don't mind. I just have to follow them a little bit. Then they turn around and start coming and walk straight back to me. So this should be good. Try and get one here. There's one just down here. Look at that. A couple of them coming close, I think. This one will come close. So I might have to take the scope off to have a go at this one. These buddies over there as well. Actually might have to use the shotgun. Try and get a double shot off. You 
never know. Done it with moose. Try it with bison. Why not? Yeah, they're both sort of coming up the hill there. That one's really close. Let's see what the other one does. I'm going to use the shotgun now. The other one's turned and going to walk off, so I'm going for this one. That one looked like a good hit. Hopefully that has gone down or won't run too far. That <laughs> sounds awesome. You need to get out there and shoot it. It is a fun gun. I don't use it too often. I thought I would today. And here we are. This is the shotgun one. There we go. Let's go find its friend. That looks like a lot of blood. It is a vital hit. And we have tracked it down, didn't get too far at all. This looked a bit darker than the other one. It may be a male. Let's get a bit closer and have a look. Yeah, it looks a bit darker, doesn't it? And it's got a big buff head and neck. Hopefully it's a male. Not a bad looking bison at all. Yeah, it's a male, a silver one. And I've got about 58% of my quick kill bonus so I'm doing okay so far am hitting them hard and killing them okay got a couple of stragglers in front of me gonna shoot this one in the back we'll see what happens yeah it should be able to kill it from there and it's buddies running off so that's pretty much the end of the herd for me I think there's only about one more left and took care of them pretty quick I think only one so far I have missed the quick kill bonus that was the plan today. So this one, I should get 100% of the quick kill bonus because that bullet would have snapped its back. Yeah, that one also 100%. So I think that's my second one. Bison today. Got quick kill bonus of 100%. So pretty happy with that. And now we have killed pretty much the whole herd. I think one got away, but I'm not going to track it down. I'll let that one go and it can tell everyone what happened. So here's one of the towers that I did put up earlier, probably, I don't know, a month ago or something. Let's have a look at it. Got a little hunting cabin behind it there. Looks pretty cool. But we did open up two of those little hunting shed things or shacks. One tower, got that out the way. Thought I'd go have a quick uh, bison hunt. Just love hunting them still after my diamond bison. That's why I bought all the heavy equipment today, but failed on that one. Haven't found it yet. Hope you enjoyed that, guys. I enjoyed bringing it to you. Thanks for dropping by, and I'll catch you on the next one.